Hey, how's it going? It's Ryan here with Intersection Records, and I'm here to wish Willie Nelson a happy 90th birthday. Uh, he was born in Abbott, Texas on the 29th of April, 1933. Started a professional career in 1956. In 1961, writes and records what would become really a country music standard, Crazy which Patsy Cline covers and again makes into one of the most famous country music songs of all time. He moves to Nashville. Uh, he stays in Nashville. He's kind of a clean cut guy trying to do the Nashville thing. And ultimately, you know, leaves and goes back to Austin, Texas, where he kind of reinvents himself and starts and pioneers what is now known as outlaw country. You know, I don't know everything there is to know about Willie Nelson. I first saw Willie in 1994 at the Superdome in New Orleans at one of his first farm aids where not only did uh, he come out and jam with Neil Young and Crazy Horse on All Along the Watchtower, but he performed with his band and it was spectacular. Over the years, I've seen him um, in Indianapolis, uh, St. Louis, uh, many times over the years and you know, even two or three years ago, when he was 86 or 87 years old, he came out and performed, and you know, it kind of always opens up with Whiskey River, right? And this last time, I'm like, man, he sounds a little rough. And then the next song got better. And then the next song got better. And by two or three, four songs into the show, he's in his prime again. And he's taking leads on that old guitar that he has with a hole in it. And you realize then and there that you're you're seeing an American legend, and it's American legend and American icon is thrown around very loosely. Now, I was born in 1972. I just turned 50. Willie's 40 years older than me. Willie's career started 15 years before I was born. He's always been there on every award show, on every on every, you know, TV appearance, you know, back in the day in the 70s and 80s. I've known him my whole life on some level. And, you know, to think that he's still around and still touring, I'm going to see him this summer. He's playing with Robert Plant and Allison Krauss and Trampled by Turtles. And I'm going to see him again. He's got his kids, I think Micah and Lucas in his band. Uh, maybe he has a daughter in his band too. You know, one record that I would definitely recommend is Stardust. This is a master work and a classic album. I don't think I have my glasses here with me, but you know, just the title track, Stardust Alone, Blue Skies is on this. Maybe I do have some glasses, I apologize. This is just tremendous. It's got some jazz elements. Georgia on my mind, Stardust, which is a Hoagie Carmichael song. Unchained Melody, All of Me, All of Me. I mean, this is like, September song on the sunny side of the street, moonlight in Vermont. Don't get around much anymore. Someone to watch over me. Produced and arranged by Booker T. Jones. Stardust. This is phenomenal place to start. This isn't as much of a country record as it is almost just an American songbook record and with jazz elements. Uh, you know, Poncho and Lefty. Um, Mamas don't let your babies grow up to be cow, you know, boys. I mean, just just a, a, an American icon. Happy birthday, Willie. Um, it's amazing that you're still doing it and doing it well. And we wish you many more years. Uh, hopefully 10 years from now, we're still doing this. Subscribe to my channel. We do shows every single day. Uh, peace out. Be good to each other. See you.